Moscow has hit key infrastructure at the Black Sea port of Odessa, Ukraine's main export hub. Two cruise missiles were reportedly shot down by air defense forces, but two hit their marks. No significant damage was caused to the port infrastructure. The pump station was hit, it caught fire and the fire was put out. But as with all of Russia's expanding offensive, civilians continue to bear the brunt. Fighting on the ground remains concentrated in the eastern Donetsk Oblast. However, air attacks are continuing to impact civilians elsewhere. On Saturday, local officials said 13 Russian missiles hit military and railroad facilities in Kirovohorod, a province closer to the capital, Kiev, than it is to Donetsk. The strikes reportedly killed some and have left many without electricity. It's the latest in a nationwide crisis brought on by six months of Russian attacks on the country. Living conditions for all Ukrainians have continued to deteriorate. Over half a million people remain without gas and electricity due to damage to critical infrastructure, especially in the east. People in Mariupol continue to lack access to safe drinking water. And the fighting continues elsewhere. Russia's defense ministry said its troops had destroyed four American-made long-range multi-launch rocket systems, known as HIMARS, in the last three weeks. On Kiev's side, British intelligence says Ukrainian forces are working to repel Russia from Kherson province. President Vladimir Zelensky has said a ceasefire without reclaiming Ukrainian land would only give the Russians time to rest. But stalled diplomacy and continued attacks make the outcome of this war far from certain. Sarah Balter, TRT World.